and I like felt something weird on my back and I reached to my back and I pull off half black hoodie I'm back cooking these goodies look at these views from cooking these foods yeah hey yo what up world what's good with y'all back with another one hope you're doing very well i am looking stoned i promise i'm not it's fine if you think i am i don't really care because whatever uh weed is very legal now so we basically it's fine but uh i'm not i'm just very tired i had like two hours of sleep and i just went like i worked and i'm just getting off and i'm so starving and it's like mid-afternoon and I just, I had like hugest McDonald's craving that I couldn't kick. And this is the most classic like meal for me, just a nugget, a Mac and some fries. So let's get into it. I, I need to get this while it's at least still pretty hot. And you know, it's Monopoly season out here. So we're gonna have to definitely check those. Maybe we'll wait till the end to see if we've won. I'm not gonna lie, I'm mildly annoyed. I asked for two sweet and sour and two barbecue and she gave me four barbecue. So I have no idea how that was misinterpreted. Like sweet and sour and barbecue don't sound at all similar in their pronunciation. So I'm very confused about it. But hey, it is what it is. I do love McDonald's barbecue and we can live with it. It will be fine. Lucky for them, I do love the fries dipped in barbecue. Mm -hmm. Man, these fries are just everywhere. What is happening? Oh my God, so stressful. I just had such a McDonald's grave. And when you get a McDonald's grave, I don't know about you, but for me, it's really hard to fight the urge. Now the question is, are you a multi-pincher? or a dainty single dipper. I myself go back and forth. I do like to have a substance grab. I have a nice mouthful, but there are times where I do like to do a dainty single dip. can't lie I will say I do like to get quite a bit of the fries in first just cuz who really wants a cold fry you know what I mean but this right here is definitely like a classic go-to for me just a Big Mac large fries Tiny nuggets. Very hard to go wrong with. I am missing the sweet and sour for the fries though because sweet and sour on fries is like so, so good. Coke Zero. Which, in my honest opinion, you guys, Coke Zero is a busted ass bitch. Now, here's the thing I hate Diet Coke. I'll take a Coke Zero over a Diet Coke, but still a Coke Zero. Tell me if you agree with me down below, but it's just hot trash. It doesn't even resemble the flavor of Coke at all. It has this weird like, almost like stale, stale lemony flavor.
It's the best way I can explain it. But it's not good. You know what is good though? McDonald's chicken nuggets. Can't be beat. No contest. McDonald's definitely, for me, reminds me of two things. High school and being very, very drunk. It's basically always my go-to when I'm hammered, especially like nights out, like living in Toronto. There's always one on my way home, wherever I lived. And it's always, honestly, what I craved. When I was drunk, stumbling home, and my oh my is this Big Mac good. Mm -hmm. Big Macs are perfect, I swear. Oh, that's a good burger. See, it's tough. It's like sometimes I think, okay, the Whopper is my favorite. Now I'll get a good Mac. I don't know, man. Then it's all up in the air. It's just so impossible to choose. They're both just so good in their own way. I used to love on the way home drunk as shit. Get my fat sack. Getting home. Lay out, lay out like a towel or cutting board, something. All drunk on my bed. Lay out my spread. Throw on a movie or whatever. Eat. And just McDonald's when you're drunk is just so glorious. Eat and then I would always just pass out. Beside it usually. And my channel's at the point where... I don't know if I've told this story before because here's the thing like it's so hard for me to remember these days all the little stories I have told and sometimes I'll even be trying to think about my past life and remember stuff to tell you guys but I'll like stockpile it so in my mind, it seems like I've already told you, but maybe I haven't. So it's like weird, but if I've never said this before, then that's good. But I've, uh, I one time <laughs> passed out evidently like mid McDouble eat. And I woke up the next day. You know, hung over, go to the bathroom to take take a pee.
and I like felt something weird on my back. And halfway through, or well, through the night, because I, when I passed out, I obviously rolled around, and I reached to my back, and I pulled off half, in half eaten, like stuck to my back, McDouble or double cheeseburger. Looked ahead while taking a pee. Fully debated taking a bite. Didn't take a bite. Had some class about it. Look at that. This thing is perfect. This is like one of the best Big Macs I've ever had in my life. Stumbled back to my bed. Come to realize it's just a mess. It looks like a murder occurred or a a period sex. I'm just going to say it. But there's just ketchup everywhere from me rolling around in this burger. And like, I used to like dump a ketchup pool. So obviously that spread everywhere. It was just trash. So I had to quickly deal with that. Fun times. This meal's going down a little too perfect right now. And then, yeah, as far as high school, it was just... McDonald's was, was the closest fast food to my school, so... It was just where we, we would skip. We used to hit McDonald's like four times a week. Skip. Usually lunch and then skip the next period and then go back for last. Or we'd skip second, have lunch, skip third, go back for fourth. Or sometimes just skip the, skip the whole thing. Sometimes. With the amount I skipped school, I honestly have no idea how I even managed to graduate, but I did. I always <clears throat> was able to squeak by. Got a couple of fry fragments here, but we must actually see, did we win anything? Nope. Nope. I'm fully convinced that <clears throat> beyond them actually giving away like a muffin or a sandwich, that this shit's all a scam anyways. I don't think anybody actually wins anything in terms of like the real prizes. Come on, let me get a let me get a free sando. Ah, uh, ah, uh, medium fries. There we are. Rolling in the big box, baby. Nope, nothing there. All right. Yeah, that was perfect. Sometimes a nice. McD, McD's meal is just it's too perfect it's what you need even though it's exactly what you don't need you know what I mean so till the next one you know what to do eat good live well stay true